Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and enable remote play and how you can also access your console remotely on the PSN app and stuff like that. You can also go ahead and like uh, get like one of those PSN remote things on your phone but I don't really recommend you guys to do that, like that's the worst way how you can play it. Just use your PS4 controller. So let's go over to here, system on system on here you want to go over to here power saving and over here features available in rest mode so what you want to do is basically enable it and then you want to enable this over here while in rest mode you can turn on your ps5 remotely using the playstation app or remote play so you can also use your remote play like you see and you can also like i said guys get it on your phone and just log in with your same account and then just basically access it with remote play and let's go ahead and go back so this is how you can enable it and now let's go for to some couple other things so remote play we can enable remote play right over here too so these are basically the things you can also link the device connection history and stuff like that it's really that simple guys i'm gonna go ahead and turn these off because i'm using my hotspot right now and i don't want to use all of my internet and like you can read guys one rest mode your ps5 can download update files and content so which means that it will use my internet if i accidentally go for to rest mode so yeah and let me check if i'm not downloading anything all right because i was down i actually downloaded a lot of stuff that i didn't even know about because i was just on my hotspot and I have a little issue with my Wi-Fi connection, so that's the reason why I'm using Hotspot. And yeah, thank you for watching, guys. Please like, subscribe, and take care.